Hi guys, and welcome to the introduction to this series on how to make a 3D endless runner in Unity. This is a beginner series, so I will be taking you through the entire process step by step, all in real time. We will be creating a temple run like game with a player that speeds up as time goes on, ground tiles that automatically spawn and delete themselves, obstacles that restart the game if the player touches them, and coins that the player can collect to gain points. This series will be five videos, and I'll quickly summarise what we'll cover in each one. In the first video, we will create the player. It will automatically move forward, can be controlled to move left and right, and the camera will follow it as well. The second video will cover making the endless level. We will create new tiles as the player moves forward, and destroy old tiles once the player has moved past them. The third video will cover obstacles. They will spawn in with the ground tiles, and the game will restart if the player touches an obstacle. We will also make the game restart if the player falls off the edge. The fourth video will cover coins. We will spawn in a random number of coins on each tile, randomise their positions, and increase the player's score every time they collect one. We will also put some text on the screen so that the player can keep track of their score. Finally, we'll touch up our project in the fifth video, learning best practices when coding, allowing the player time to prepare themselves at the start of the game, and making the player speed up over time to increase the difficulty. If enough people are following along by the end, I'll continue this series and we'll look at creating sound effects, spawning different types of tiles such as narrow tiles or tiles with rails, right corners for the player to turn, keeping track of the high score and distance, and more. That's the end of this video, thanks for watching and I'll see you in part 1.